Welcome! Here is Visual Effects tutorial here. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Adobe Premiere Pro title editor in order to create an amazing title for your sequences and your projects. Premiere Pro has a really amazing title editor with a lot of functions and parameters. To create a new title in Premiere Pro, just click on File, click New, and then choose Title. Press OK. This is the Premiere Pro Title Editor. Here you can create uh, your title, uh, you can create shapes, you can uh, customize your title and everything you want to do with this tool will be added in your tab, in your new title. So let's begin. This is the preview window. Uh, you, here you will see every everything you will change in the title, everything you will edit, uh, you will see in the preview window. This is the title toolbar. Here is uh, uh, the all the tools you can use in order to make titles. Here is the title styles. Uh, with this, these are some, uh, kind of preset for your titles. These are the title action, so you can align, distribute your title. These are some title option, and as the title properties with all the parameters you can set. To create a new title, just click on the Type tool, D click and drag to create a new text box. You can choose a title style if you want. I will use this one and type something. Okay, this is the our title. If you don't like the style, just select the title and choose another style by clicking on it. Here are some properties, for example, the test width, the test height, the size of the font, the font type. You, you can also set uh, if underlined to use the italic or the bold. So if align the, the center of the text box in the right or in the left. Just click. Increase by dragging. OK. This is our new, our new title. With the selection tool you can move in the uh, directly in the preview just clicking on the text box you can in the title properties you can set all the properties of the title every parameter is here you can find it here for example the opacity the title opacity the opacity is the transparency so everything that is below our title will be visible if we set our opacity lower than Z, than 100 for example 50 now we'll set it to 100 the position the width at the height of the text box the rotation the font style properties and everything we just can this is the font family just change the font as the font uh, just click on it. Premiere Pro provide the preview of the font. This is really useful and will save you a lot of time. We can add 
many strokes to your title just just clicking enabling the stroke adding it for example here is the stroke settings the inner strokes the outer stroke you can adjust the size the color your stroke the opacity of the stroke itself you can also set the fill of the title is the solid the linear gradient the radial gradient for colors gradient and behavior eliminate or ghost for example we can set linear gradient here we can choose the color to put in our gradient for example I choose blue and black we can move our gradients it is really really useful we can also set the angle of our of our gradient for example if I set it to 90 it will be vertical this could be really bad okay now here is here is the title action so just select the text text box and we can align to the vertical or higher horizontal center just click on it this is the pen tool this tool is, is used to create a new shapes just clicking on the preview custom shape so click and then close everything you will create in Premiere Pro will be will have the same parameter of the last text you've created for example here you can see the red stroke we set before for our text same thing is we can if we create another shape like the rectangle with the rectangle to we can see there is the linear gradient we set before for our for our text the rotation tool is really useful in order to re rotate shapes and text if we don't want a layer like a shape uh, we created it just cancel it delete it pressing cans cancel in your keyboard Okay, this is all you have to know about the title editor. If you finished, just close the title editor and the text will be automatically added to our media library in Premiere Pro. And we can see there is something like a normal clip, so we can add it to a sequence. We can add it to the timeline, we can add a, a footage. For example, this default footage you can find in window. That's why I named our title beer. Okay, as you can see, there is the motion in the effects control panel, the opacity just like a normal clip we can also set and uh, add the normal effects so, uh, something like the fast blur hey, everything is normal i see everything you can do with a clip you can also do it with a title just drag the effect to So you, we, here you can see 
that we the title appears with a fast blur with a, a fading effects this is really useful this is amazing I think the Premiere Pro title editor is the best title editor in every other editing program so that's all thank you for watching um, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial you learned something and uh, how to use the Premiere Pro title editor and how to apply effects if you liked our tutorial don't forget to subscribe to our channel in order to support our activity and to get new tutorials thank you again see you the next time